morning guys so I am so late doing this because it is Monday it is Memorial Day and so I am very late but I thought I would go ahead and do it now so it is not quiet in my house but it never is but I want to use this free printable from Victoria Thatcher and it is I Love Lucy I used to watch this all the time so I think it's so cute which all of her printables are really cute so I'm just gonna go ahead and get started all of her printables are amazing, so if you haven't used them, you definitely should try it out. Um, I will leave her link below like I have been doing, um, but it's just, I mean, I can't believe it's free because she does such a great job, but they're really cute. So I have been sucking it up with videos lately, you guys. I've been so busy that all this stuff has been going on and it's been crazy that I hope to get back on track. I still have some things that are happening in my life right now that are making things a little bit up in the air to where I don't really know what's going on for sure. Um, my grandfather is in the hospital. He has been in the hospital for over a week now and he um, is supposed to have surgery tomorrow so I'm not sure exactly what's going to happen. But hopefully that will just go well and everything will be fine and it won't be a big deal. And I don't know, I'm just hoping for the best here. I'm definitely praying for him. So if you, if you think of him, definitely give him a prayer because we could always use it. Everybody could use prayer, but he is not in the best of conditions and he has a lot of things going on with his heart. Um, a lot of his arteries are blocked and all of that kind of stuff and he's just not they don't want to do major surgery because they don't think that he will make it through that so they're trying to do the best that they can to help him and it's not really a lot to be honest <laughs> so I'm hoping that number one that he can be totally fine and okay and that everything will work out and number two I'm hoping that he, um, he has a better quality of life after they get done because it's just, it's been really rough for him. So I think I'm going to use this washi on top of here because it's really cute. But I just, there's been so much going on, you guys, not in a bad way, just busy, busy, busy. So I found out I was pregnant and I know I've already released that announcement video. So you guys have seen that. Um, but I did find out I was pregnant and then, um, if you are new, this will be my third and, um, then after that, I, uh, Tristan went into the hospital because he was really sick and he had a, um, a digestive blockage, like he had an intestinal blockage and he, um, was in the hospital for a night and they got that figured out and taken care of. And then when we got home from that, um, while we were in the hospital for that, my grandfather actually went into the hospital and um, had a stroke. And they weren't really sure what was going on or what to do about it. Because like I said, he is like really high risk for any type of surgery right now. And not only that, but he is like allergic to a lot of the drugs and stuff and so that's really rough and scary so that was going on while Tristan was in the hospital so that's really scary and then um, then we just had you know regular life with um, church and all of that kind of stuff and just all that craziness and then, um, yeah, so I mean, it's just been a lot. <laughs> it has been a lot. Let's see, I'm going to use this weekend sticker first before I put that down. But all of it's not been bad. Some of it's actually been really, really good. Oh, and also my dad graduated with his second master's degree in Tennessee. So we went there to be with him for that. So that was a lot of fun. But that was a two and a half hour trip that we went to. And so me and the boys did that and Joshua ended up surprising us and being able to be there as well. 
So that was cool. And so it's just been busy, 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 busy. And then um, we got home and went to church and did all of those things that we always do. And it's just been a lot. So I'm ready to get back on track and back into our routine. So my, like I said, my grandfather is still in the hospital, so we don't really know what's going on with that. I should know more about that tomorrow, so he will be in surgery tomorrow, and um, after that, we'll know a little bit more, but I know my mom went to be with him. It's my mom's dad. She's already lost her mom, and so she's really nervous, as can be expected, and I'm just hoping that everything goes really really well and that it's all going to be fine and he will have a better quality of life because he's just had such a hard time um i'm trying to find a floral that is cute with this because i want to put some washi down and i don't see any that i really i'm just going gaga over with this um yeah, but I am hoping that it's, see that's just too pink, and this one's still a little too red, so I'm like, um, okay. Nothing's working, and I don't like that one either. Well, I might just use this one, but, um, yeah, so. We just got a lot going on, and um, hopefully it will die down soon. I feel like, I told Joshua, I was like, I feel like we were robbed because we just found out we were pregnant, and before we even had time to process it, all of these other things have been happening all at the same time, so it's like, whoa, it's like a whirlwind of craziness all at once, so we really haven't had time to truly process what's going on. Um, because all of this other stuff has been happening, so we're kind of still in a daze a little bit, but we were definitely excited to find out we were pregnant, so that is good. Um, we were, I was like, no, I think it's going to be a negative, and then I showed him the pregnancy test, and you know, if you've ever taken a pregnancy test, that it shows up negative first, and then the positive slowly creeps. And I waited for a few minutes and the negative was showing up and nothing else was. And I was like, see, it's negative. And he was like, uh, that's not negative. And he started looking at it closer and it for sure was turning positive. I was like, yay. I was excited. And so was he. He was like holding up the pregnancy test and screaming out the window that it was positive. He was excited. So it's always cute. He's always so excited every time I've been pregnant, which this is the last time. So this is his last chance because I'm not doing this again, but he's always so excited. Um, every time I've ever been pregnant, it's adorable to look, watch him. Cause you guys know, like he's not the most expressive person in the world. They're playing with each other and fighting Mama. with them. What? I see that, man. That's cool. This, this wow. That's so cool. I see. Wow. That is so cool. Oh, wow. Are you fighting with Tristan's man? Yes. Okay. Oh. Uh -oh. He said I'm making some cupcakes. They're playing with Play-Doh and he's playing with some robot guy that I don't think he's ever played with before so he thought it necessary to come and show me. Adorable. My kids are so darn cute. I can't even stand it sometimes. I'm like, are you really mine? You are mine and you're so darn cute. I can't even believe I get to look at you all the time. You're so cute. So, anyway, I don't even know what I was saying, but, oh, he's just always, he's not the most expressive person, but he 
always get so excited when I'm pregnant. And I think it is just the most adorable thing because you know he's so excited because he's not expressive and he's showing it. So it's like, that is so cute. So he loves his babies. He is a good daddy. So I don't mind doing it one more time, but one more time is all we're doing. So this is the end. No more after this. I think I'm going to do some of this washi. I was kind of debating on whether I wanted to or not, but I think I am. I think I'm going to do it right here. Just put this here. But, like I said, I'm just wanting things to be normal again. I feel like it's been a long time <laughs> since they were. And I have been off schedule so bad on my videos, and I apologize. It has just been wild. And I have not been home and not been able to film like I want to, and it's crazy. I'm hoping, like I said, that my grandfather's surgery goes well and everything's okay with that. Um, to be honest with you, I, th I think he's just kind of at the point himself where... If they can't do anything to help him, he's just ready to go. And I don't blame them because the way he's living now, is with all of this blockage, it's hard for him to breathe. He can't get around well. He's very, very independent. And he can't do a lot of things for himself, and it's making him miserable. So, honestly, I don't blame him. I think sometimes we are selfish and we want... Our loved ones to stay with us and so we don't want them to go so you know we kind of want to prolong things but he is just not he does not have the best quality of life right now because of all of this stuff that's going on and they're just not able to really help him at all and that's very very frustrating and I know it's frustrating for him I can't imagine not being able to be independent and do things for yourself when you have been that way your whole life. I mean, I know that it would bother me. So anyways, I don't mean to be dark and depressing, but that is just kind of what we're going through right now. So like I said, maybe his surgery will go well and they will be able to help him and everything will be much better. I think I'm going to use the lower colors because this is really bright and the yellow that's in this kit is kind of toned down a little bit. So I think I'll use that part. I hope that you guys have had a good couple of weeks while I have been kind of MIA. I, I think I've been doing enough like sporadic videos that I've been keeping up with you guys as best I can. I just haven't been here as much as usual so I want to remedy that. I'm going to fix that situation. It's just going to take me a second. So just bear with me. I'm doing the best I can and I'm going to get back on track. I promise. I feel like every week I keep saying I need to catch up in my planners and then I don't and all of that. But it's just been, like I said, really crazy. So I've been trying to get everything back on track and under control. And it's harder than it sounds. <laughs> but I know that you guys are amazing and that you understand because you guys really are wonderful. And I truly appreciate the support that you guys give me. You're pretty awesome, so I know that it's okay. You're very understanding and sweet to me. I'm very lucky to have you guys to watch my crazy but sometimes boring life. <laughs> I do very much appreciate it. I don't think I say that enough, but I truly do. And these boys are being so sweet playing together. It is making my heart smile. There's nothing better for a mama than to hear her boys play and be sweet together. Like, it, it's just wonderful. I'm so happy they've Killian's finally getting old enough to really play, and he's communicating so much better at two, and so he's able to 
you know, talk and I think I'm going to use this washi. He's able to talk and play and do sound effects with Tristan and, you know, do boy things that make it fun to play with him. So Tristan's started to play with him so much more and it's really cute to see them play together. It's cute to watch him play by himself too, but it's really cute to see them play and be sweet together. Because you guys know, siblings are not always sweet to each other. They are rough and mean. <laughs> and at five and two, their age gap is enough to where sometimes it's not always the sweetest, most kind encounters with each other. They get pretty rough. Okay, I'm starting to run out of stickers. But I still have a lot of these that I can use. So I'm going to use some of these on my sidebar. And I honestly, you guys, um, in this planner, I don't even use this sidebar for very much. Um, I like to write down, this is the planner that I use if you are new. This is the planner that I use for my YouTube. I do have a blog, but I haven't done very much with it. I do have an Etsy, but I have been neglecting it. So this is what I use for my Etsy, my blog, I need to start that back up honestly, and for my, um, uh, did I say YouTube already? For my YouTube. So that's what I use it for. So I like to put when I upload, um, I like to put um, when I upload a video and then when I film it. So that I know exactly what's going on. I'm trying to decide, do I even want to put this right here? Or do I not? There's not even a lot of blue in it. This green got a little bit messed up, but I'm still going to use it because I just don't want to waste it. There's a little bitty sticker strip stuck to it, and if I pull it off, then it's going to mess up the paper. So... I don't want to pull it off, but it's going to drive me bonkers. But again, I don't want to waste it, so hopefully when I write over it, it won't get on my nerves as much. Oh wait, I'm getting it off. Totally getting it off. Go girl, get it off. Fix it, fix it. Okay, there we go. So I wasn't expecting to get that off, but I did. So there's that. And then I think I'm just going to leave the rest of it. Put this washi down. And then maybe one more of these. But anyway, I am I'm excited about all the good things that are happening. I'm a little nervous about some of the things that still have to kind of the chips have to fall and we have to see what's going on, but other than that, I'm really excited about the new things that are happening in my life. They're exciting things, huh? So I'm glad to share them with you guys. Because <clears throat> what is fun stuff if you don't have anyone to share it with? Not very much. It's not nearly as fun, that's for sure. <clears throat> I think I'm going to use a couple of these. They're going to be a little bit wide, maybe. I don't think it's going to be too terrible. Wouldn't be terrible if you wouldn't put it crooked. I can hear the piece dwindling. I just heard a hey, stop. Okay, that's cute. I kind of wish I would have used more of those if I would have known they fit so perfectly. I'm kind of excited about that because I got these in an 80 count from the Dollar Tree. So that's exciting that they fit so well. Almost fit perfect. So yes, please. Need to grab some more of those, especially in black. <clears throat> so that is going to be that. And let's see what the date is. I will also show you my spread from last week because I did not end up posting the video. It was really cloudy and yucky looking. 
and I didn't like it. I think I am going to put some of this washi on the side because it looks uneven and jangity. So I need something for that edge, I think. But the video was cloudy. I think sometimes, you guys, I'm terrible about my kids have gotten a hold of my phone. And I'm terrible about not checking the lens to see if it's cloudy. And I can't see the viewfinder from, from this angle. So I have to stand up to see it. And so sometimes I'm guilty of not looking in the viewfinder to see how good the quality of the picture is. And it will be really cloudy and I won't even realize. So, yeah. So I'm so guilty of that. And that's what happened. It was just not focusing and it was, I think some sticky fingers had gotten on the lens. I'm not really sure what happened, but it was just not a good quality video. And I, I love the spread so much, like the printable I used. But the quality was so bad, I was like, I just can't, I can't do that. <laughs> I cannot post that video. It's just not good. You would be squinting, wondering if your eyes were playing tricks on you, and I just can't. Every now and then, if I catch it in the middle, I might still post it, but it was the whole way through, and I was like, no, I'm just not going to do that. Okay, so I need to update this for summer, all of my planners. So this was it, and I will show it to you in just a moment. I'm not going to write anything in here because I kind of like to do it as I go. So I will probably write this video in on a Monday because I hope to post this today. And then this is the 28th, 29th, 31st, 1st, 2nd, and 3rd. Today is Memorial Day. Okay, so there is that, you guys. I love it. I think it's so darn cute. And the kit actually went really far. So I brought in these, and then I brought in just these two. That's it. Everything else was from the kit. So, Oh, and I also brought in these check boxes right here. So the kit went a long way. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this. This was from last week. This really pretty lemon printable, which is also from Victoria Thatcher. I love it. I think it's so gorgeous and I wish that my video would have went up but that's okay. You can see it now and then I'm going to do a flip through as well of the last few months so you'll be able to see it in there as well. But this is for this week. Hopefully this week will be filled with wonderful videos for you guys. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this. Thank you so much for joining me and watching. If you are not a subscriber, please hit that button. Hit it now. Hit it fast. Hit the bell button so you know when I post a video. Leave your comments down below because I love to talk to you guys. And definitely give it a thumbs up. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.